camera, please. Ah, oh, oh. ah, the call of the wild. Habits of the local species. <sighs> the flight of majestic birds. <laughs> the bond between parent and child. Doing what animals do. It doesn't get any wilder than this. Oh yeah. What is it? It's a photocopy machine. Allow me to demonstrate. Yuck! Why are the keys all gummy? Excuse me. One grilled cheese sandwich coming up, Tito. It collates too. <sighs> hmm. Where's that kid with my morning paper? Oh. Now, where are those TV listings? Here, tonight at eight. When the West was wet. Ooh, an event of this magnitude just screams for peanut brittle. My horoscope says I'm going to meet a tall, dark stranger, and he will be instantly smitten with me. I get that a lot. <laughs> My horoscope says beware of geeks bearing gifts. <laughs> This qualifies. Horror skill. <laughs> uh oh, mine says I shouldn't eat alone. Hey Elmo, want to split a vegetable lasagna? Can't. My horoscope says I can only eat small, slimy, green things today. Uh, that's my cue to get out of the water. <laughs> What kind of fool lets a newspaper column run his life? What are you doing? My horoscope said not to watch where I'm going, but where I've been. I didn't know Dodo and New were the same sign. By the way, what's your sign, Eugene? Uh, the one with the horns and the wings and the fat head and the. Got it. Huh? What's it say? Nothing. Not a thing. What makes you think it says anything? And remember, I only read it. I didn't write it. Forget it. It's peanut brittle time. <laughs> It got more brittle than peanut. Oh, which way's west? My horoscope says I have to watch the sunset, or I'll grow hair on my face. These poor, pathetic creatures. Why would they take their horoscope so seriously? I don't know where you had lunch, but you better get your stub back to the coat check girl. I lost my fur. I lost it because I ignored my horoscope and took one step forward. One lousy step. You think all your fur fell out because you disobeyed your horoscope? That's ridiculous. Your condition is nothing more than a. Incidents. Sports section, entertainment, financial, fashion. Lad is coming back. Hmm, that'll be a good read. Here it is, horoscope. Today, danger lurks. Don't go anywhere. That's ridiculous. I don't believe a word of it.
coincidence? Well, don't I look quite the fool? Get a hold of yourself, Eugene. There's got to be a way to beat this thing. Of course. If I travel in disguise, I won't be recognized. I feel like a New York subway seat. Tweet. <clears throat> Tweet. Here goes. Tweet. 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 Oh. No good lousy newspaper. I refuse to be outsmarted by a horoscope prediction. Here I am. You, Eugene, in the flesh. <laughs> like stealing candy from a chip. I'm a genius. Remember that day our horoscope told us we could only eat blue food? If not for that incredibly old cheese, Water. we would have starved to death. Did you hear that? Hear what? Uh, I didn't hear anything. Water! There! Hear it? A weak, pathetic wailing. Someone is calling out for an otter. Or butter. Water, you doofus! Water! I'm parched and I can't leave my place to get to the pond! <laughs> Quick, what's Eugene's sign? The one with the horns and the wings and the fat head and the... Got it! Hey, it says here that his bad luck will be wiped out if Eugene is within three feet of a Leo. Yeah, sure. Where are we ever going to find a Leo? Lion? Lyle! Please don't do this to me! I'm not a full-blooded Leo! I was born on the cusp! Please! Thanks for coming. My pleasure. Is it raining? Nope. See any lightning? Hear any thunder? Uh-uh. Lyle, buddy! Oh, Brick. You are the bravest and most wonderful creature I have ever met. You understand, Tiffany, that somebody had to be. Oh, Brick, call me foolish, but I actually... Eugene, I thought you needed my help to get out of your place. Yeah, next commercial, we go for more brittle. All I'm saying is as long as your horoscope has stuck us together, why don't we do something fun? Okay, how about a game? We could play Touchy Sparky. The game goes like this. You rub your hair for a few seconds, building up an electrical charge. Then, when you touch me, I'll get a spark. Won't it hurt? Little spark? Nah. Well, all right then. Now you touch me. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, uh, tickles. <laughs> My turn. Ow! Finally, a game I can win. I'd like to introduce you to the biggest, most powerful water blaster toy in the history of the world. Take that. And that. And how about some more of this? Where'd you get that? Custom made. How about you try pushing me for a while? Yeah! I'm starting to think you don't like my company. It's not that, Eugene. But I've got things to do, too, you know. So, who's stopping you? Hello. 
Lyle. Hello, Lana. I won tickets to the fireworks show tonight. Second row. Oh. Ooh. Hooray! Encore! Encore! Hmm. View's not what you'd expect from the second row. Show's over. Time for bed. Hey, Mom, who blew out the candles? Horoscope, horoscope. Oh, here it is. It says I should eat lots of uncooked pasta and only listen to Golden Oldies Radio. That's pretty good. Won't need Lyle anymore. Good idea, Lyle. Wearing a disguise to escape Eugene. What disguise? Eugene made me sleep in his pocket. Is that today's paper? Yep, and according to today's horoscope, you have to take up stilt walking and steer clear of cotton. Who writes this stuff? Now, now, Lyle, astrology is a very complicated science. We couldn't begin to imagine what sort of research goes into these horoscopes. All right, Tito. Let's get started on tomorrow's horoscope. What's in store for Sagittarius? Slug dancing lessons are in the cards. Beware of garden slugs. Oh, fantastic! <laughs>